In case you didn't know, in 3D you can do almost everything. You wanna make realistic Pokemons? You can. You wanna make crazy looking monsters? You can. You even want to make a banana NFT collection because bananas are cool? You can. Yeah, I really made 20 bananas. It was a lonely summer. <laughs> so, what did you need to begin making 3D stuff? It's not 5 years of intense learning in a random 3D school. It's not learning how to code on a computer. It's not how to learn to draw either. All you need is a computer. And not even a computer that costs like $2000. If you want to start 3D, you don't need a too expensive one. Okay, I lied. You don't just need a computer, you also need imagination. Because again, in 3D the sky is a limit. As long as you have an idea, it's not a problem to actually make it happen. So let's jump in some real 3D stuff. But before that, let me take a small breakfast, brush my teeth, put on some better clothes, and finally, open this cool Huion tablet that they kindly sent me for this video. The Canvas 16, with a 15 inch screen with HD resolution. Now that my setup is done, and that I have my references, I'm ready for a 3D day. Hey, but you told us that we only needed a computer, and you got a tablet now. Well, that's because a computer can be the only thing you need depending on what you want to do. Technically, you can do everything with a mouse, it's true, but some things are just far more easier when you have a graphic tablet. In 3D, you have many choices for your career. You can be a character artist, an environment artist, a modeler, an animator, an ethics artist, a lighter, and so forth. Me, myself, am a character artist or at least I intend to be, when I will have finished my studies. And as a character artist, you make, well, characters. No but also animals, creatures, etc. And the thing we do a lot is sculpting. Sculpting in 3D is an amazing thing, since you can very quickly give the shapes you want to your characters and add all the tiny details you want. Your imagination will be your limit. Now, I use a software called ZBrush, god I love ZBrush, and you can have it for $10 if you are a student. Or you can also use Blender, which is the best free software for making 3D. You can do almost everything in the software, so if you're new to 3D and you want to discover 3D, I really recommend you to download Blender. I'll throw a link in the description. And thus, why a graphic tablet for sculpting? Because I'll let you try with the mouse. Really, try it. You won't even last for 3 minutes. Since when you sculpt you add or take away some clay if you want, you need to be able to make smooth strokes with the intensity you want. With the mouse you don't have any pressure, so the strength of a click will always be the maximum. And making a stroke with the mouse is... Yeah, I respect those who do it. Anyways, with a tablet, you can press harder if you want a bigger stroke, and press softer if you want a smaller stroke. Ooh, cool. I know, right? And the bonus that this Huion tablet has, is that it has a screen. So now, even if I don't use it to actually draw or sculpt on it, I can leave it on, to have not one screen, but... Two screens! Uh, yeah. So yeah, I'm really satisfied with this tablet. I'll put the link of this product in the description if you want to have a better look. And if you can't afford a tablet with a screen, no worries, you don't have to. I for example began 3D with a tablet without a screen, and I was happy with it. Huion has got a lot of variety in that tablet, so there will always be a tablet for your budget. Huion. Now that I have done sculpting, my lizard, Gecko. yeah well, Gecko, is all and well, but it's all grey. Well, that, my friends, is the first part. Every 3D object was once grey at the start, but it will evolve and gain colors. This part is called texturing, and my character will slowly become alive. Once that is done, all I need to do is put my character in a pose, because, yeah, all 3D characters are born in this position, which we call a T-pose. I then just need to turn on the light switch, and bam, you just created your first 3D character. Of course, I skipped a lot of parts, but don't worry, 
If you want to see the fill process and want to know in depth how to create these kinds of characters, go check my Gumroad store. The link is in the description. Gumroad! I hope I have convinced you by starting 3D. I know it will be a difficult journey and you will fail sometimes, but it will be worth it. In 3D, my friends, you will find inner peace. Hey, but what about all those times at 2am when you nearly smashed your computer? Uh, uh, I don't remember that. Sure you do. You even screamed, why don't it work? I hate 3D, stupid 3D. I'll never do 3D again. I hate it. Why does it only happen to me? Okay, uh, that's enough, I think. We'll end this video here. <laughs> and then you took your keyboard and you threw it out of the way. <laughs>